How is bullet drop actually calculated? Well, one of the key things we need to know is the time of flight, because what's going to happen is the second that projectile leaves the muzzle, it's going to be pulled down by gravity. It's going to be accelerating downward constantly for the entire flight time of that projectile. So when we're looking at ballistic coefficient, humidity, temperature, pressure, all those things that we're using in the ballistic calculators, all of those are just to give the inputs that it needs to be able to figure out the time of flight. Now, the other part of this is we actually need the vertical component of the velocity of the projectile. So when we're shooting, if we're not shooting perfectly flat, we're going to be tipping it up a little bit and arcing the bullet in. So that bullet is going to have some vertical velocity to it. Now we can calculate the actual positional drop of the projectile. So the equation for that is going to be that initial vertical velocity times the time of flight plus one half of the acceleration of gravity times the time of flight squared. Now because gravity is pulling down, that number is going to be a negative. So it's going to be that initial velocity times time minus that second half of the equation with gravity. Which